What's going on guys? Welcome to 2021, the year of bare ammo shelves and extremely high prices. Uh, I'm going to say I told you so, but this video is to help you make the decision to pick up a couple of these adapters. And what I'm getting at here is if you've been to the ammo shelves, you've seen that even buying 12 gauge can be somewhat of a hassle. In fact, most of the time when you get to the ammo shelves, the only thing that you can actually find as far as shotgun shells goes is 28 gauge. So today we're back out here with the Midland Arms Backpack Shotgun Brake Action. And this is an 18 inch barrel and I got the full choke sitting inside of there. Today, we're gonna find out if we can use this little three inch 12 gauge to 28 gauge adapter and take out some of these clay targets. Now, if any of you guys have seen any of my other previous videos, you know that I am not that great at throwing these clay targets. However, I have gotten better. I got a pocket full of 28 gauge shotgun shells right here and I got a handy dandy little thrower here which this thing is awesome if you haven't used these bendy ones they're pretty good I'm gonna load this up I'm gonna launch one out there these are catched some serious distance if I had to guess about 35 to 40 yards out by the time I pull the trigger so with an 18 inch barrel into a 12 gauge to 28 gauge adapter how well can we do this or well how well can I do this we're about to find out if you don't know how these work, you simply drop the adapter into your chamber, drop the shell into the adapter, close her up, and you're ready to roll. All right, again, let's see how this works out. And here we go. Make sure you guys can see where I'm, I'm gonna try to get these all on camera here. Keep this in focus. Hey, look at that. Not too bad. That's about, I don't know, 30 yards away on that one. Let's load this up and do it again. Easy enough. Drop it right in the adapter. Right into the shotgun. You ever watch that, uh, that musician? The one-man band? That's what I feel like right now. I'll tell you what, though. I'm getting pretty good at throwing those. I'm getting a lot better at hitting them. <laughs> All right. Let's load her up and do it again. I'm just going to go until I run out of shells here. Drop it in the adapter. I don't usually close it up until I'm ready to shoot, so keep this all as safe as possible. I'll tell you what, I really do like this little thrower here, though. All right, here we go. You guys good? I'm good. Let's go. Woohoo! That's about, I don't know, 35, 40 out that way on that one. Let's load up another one. There's something very, and I've said this before, very relaxing about shooting a uh, single shot. You know, especially if you're just chilling out here by yourself, you're in no rush, not, no one's waiting on you or anything like that. Taking your time, just like I am doing out here. No pressure. Woo if I didn't mention, these are number nine shot. Now, 28 gauge is actually a little more expensive than I think even 410. But when in, you know, when you don't really have anything else to shoot, and this is the only thing on your on your shelves, well, there you go. These little adapters are very capable. I've said it before, extremely capable. I'm slinging these things all the way out to 40 yards. Your typical encounter of anything flying over that you can reach with a shotgun shell, 28 gauge. Again, just an 18 inch barrel, a three inch adapter, and a full choke. We're not doing too bad. I'm gonna have to put some of these in my Mossberg just to see if I can, see if I can swing that better. This little 18 inch, this little 18 inch shotgun really is not made <laughs> for clay shooting at all. But as you can see, it's getting the job done out there when I can put them on. We'll do one more in the Midland and I'm gonna throw these, throw this adapter into my Mossberg over there and see how that fares. I can point that one a lot better. All these excuses. One video. Ready? Ugh. I had all the time in the world on that one too. I don't know what I was doing. All right, let's try that Mossberg real quick. All right, so with the pump shotgun, just a little bit different. Open the action up, throw the adapter in with the shell into it. Again, 12 gauge, 28 gauge. And we're ready to roll. Okay, here we go. 
Make sure you guys are in camera. See, when you put the bead on it, you can actually hit it. Which usually, be, usually is my major problem. I'll do a couple more. But as you can see, these are more than capable when you do your part, or well, when I do my part, of making hits out there all the way at 35, 40 yards using an adapter. Uh, this has the full choke in it as well. Now I've done velocity testing on these and surprisingly enough, even though it's coming out of a three inch chambered barrel adapter, the velocities are very close to if you were to just shoot a regular 12 gauge or 28 gauge out of the full length barrel. Oddly enough, it's very weird. Science and stuff. Ready? Woo! I told you. I told you. What'd I say? I sent it, I sent it, and I say it again. Put the bead on it, you can hit it. <laughs> oh man, I'm gonna do one more. This is where I'm gonna probably fail at it. I need another, I need another shell. Let's just do a couple more and round this video off. I'm just having fun at this point, but I think I've made my point. Again, you can check these out in the link in the description box down below for gunadapters.com. And you can use my coupon code down there and get a little discount off of your purchase. I want to thank gunadapters.com for being a sponsor of our channel and sponsoring this video and sending these adapters out to show you guys. These really do are very worth it, uh, especially in these times right now. And you guys know exactly what I'm talking about. All right, a couple more, here we go. Woo! I'm on fire! Having way too much fun out here as always, guys. But again, I'll have that link down there in the description box down below. Be sure to check them out if you haven't heard of these. I have plenty more videos on my channel under the playlist, Gun Adapters Testing. Very interesting results out of a lot of these. But when the shelves are bare, and I've said it before, I'll say it again, it's kind of nice to have some of these adapters. Everybody said, you'll always be able to find 12 gauge. Look who's talking now, buddy. Last one. I think I just cursed myself. This is probably going to be a miss. Yeah. Oh, I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. Oh, that's all right. Guys, I appreciate you watching. Uh, again, I have the link down there in the description box down below for gunadapters.com. These are more than capable. Even with this 12 gauge, all the way down to 28 gauge, out there at... 35 to 40 yards on a little clay bird. Good velocities out there. You can see when I do my part, put the bead on it, something happens magically and that clay bird goes exploding. So guys, we'll catch you on the next video. Appreciate you watching. See you next time.